Let's see what Todd has to say about his Batman 66. McFarland here. Guess what? Retro is hot, right? And guess what we're going to be coming out with? Our new line of Batman from the TV, classic TV series from 1966. Right? This is a TV show, I'm sure my age, this is a TV show that I watch. Came on twice a week. You had the cliffhanger on Tuesday, and then you had the second part that solved the crime on Thursday. But these are a couple of the characters. Obviously, you're going to get Batman, a.k.a. Adam West, Bruce Wayne. Here it is. Going to have the retro packaging. Going to have some cool little sort of sound effects like they had in the TV show. Uh, I got a cloth cape on them. If you want to get in there, you can see the face, you can see the cloth cape that's in there. Uh, Robin too, right? Burt Ward was the actor. Uh, here he is, looking good. There's going to be some variants on some of those. We'll show you some of the stuff out of the package. And then of course you have to have a villain. So you got Cesar Romero, look at him, Joker, with the cool stuff in here. Uh, but, it's not all. Besides getting the characters, they are going to come with some accessories. And who doesn't need the old classic Batmobile built from that old Cadillac, right? This, to me, I know depending on how old you are, you have your favorite Batmobile. This is mine. I remember one day at a car auction, I almost bought one of these. I had it up. I could have had one of them. would have been awesome. And then we'll show you how that works. And then, last but not least, the super cool one is, and you don't quite get the value of it, but this is going to be the Batcave. See the back of it here that it all opens up and you're going to have like a bunch of pieces but instead of looking at the photography here let's go and take a look at this stuff right here so we've got but here's the batmobile here it's going to come with a little piece of cardboard because remember it would come in and it would spin uh we couldn't unfortunately do a full circle which it was so it would spin in the tv show because we didn't have enough packaging but We've got rolling wheels, got some cool detail on it, and then we have sort of the cool front. Look at that! <laughs> Look at nice grill, nice detail, and then Batman here. Both the figures will sit in it. Obviously, here's Batman and Robin. Let's come take a look at the two caped crusaders, as we like to call them. Here we go right here. There's Robin. Here's Batman. Turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it. And now, if we take a look at it and we go back here, then we're going to get the bat cave, right? We pull way, 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 way back. You're going to see how much you actually get. You get the bat cave, and then you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven pieces of machinery that was throughout the bat cave. So you can move these around any way you want, put them wherever you want, but you're going to get tons and tons of the computers that they used to work on. And then you're going to get Batman and Robin. And then obviously, as I said, you can put them in here, bend them a little bit, and they'll both basically then come in here and sit in the car. So you can get them into the car, and then you can drive them around in the car. So, there they are. Oh, I don't have any light, right? But you'll sit down nice and tight. And now you'll have Robin looking pretty cool, sitting in the, in the car. I just tuck his cape down and you can sit on it. Uh, so all this is going to be coming out at the same time. Like I said, if you want, uh, figures should be reasonably priced. I think the back cave is going to be around 30 bucks, 25, 30 bucks. Same for the Batmobile. So you can get all this easily uh, be in and out of it uh, for 100, under 100 bucks uh, for the whole setup right here. So if you're a big fan of the classic Batman, like I was, right? Adam West, coolest guy ever. Uh, make sure you go and take a look for that. It's going to be out in store soon. Target's going to have it. So this is probably the coolest part for me, given the symbols of what they say, kapow, bang, boom. There's your Batman, Adam West. Looks really good. The face replication is good on that one. There's the packaging, looks nice as well. Got that nice 66 look to it. And I hope everyone does come with a different uh, phrase there, pow, kapow, whatnot, we'll see. There's Robin, not really interested in that head sculpt. It does not look like the character in my opinion. Joker looks amazing, I do like this one a lot. Looks like Cesar Romero. 
Batmobile looks good from the first standpoint. I'll show you something here in a second. Uh, but really cool is they're getting that and the Batcave um, in this particular line. So that is awesome that we're going to get in that. 24 inches he's saying here, wide. And there it is on a little cardboard cutout piece. It would have been nice if that was actually something plastic to spin as well. But look right there. Look at Robin sitting in the car. And again, we'll zoom in here in a second. Here's the image I want to show you compared to the real Batmobile in the car. Notice how far their heads are down below the windshield. And there's your comparison between the toy. So the scale is not right for this toy, it looks like. And their heads are sticking way out from the car. Just my opinion. Don't know what you guys think about it. Let me know in the comments. Talk to you guys later.